What does model.eval do in PyTorch? When should I use .eval? I understand it is supposed to allow me to evaluate my model. How do I turn it back off for training? Example training code using .eval. Model.eval is a kind of switch for some specific layers slash parts of the model that behave differently during training and inference, evaluating, time. For example, dropouts layers, batch norm layers etc. You need to turn them off during model evaluation, and .eval will do it for you. In addition, the common practice for evaluating slash validation is using torch.no underscore grad in pair with model.eval to turn off gradients computation. But, don't forget to turn back to training mode after eval step. You can turn off evaluation mode by running model.train. You should use it when running your model as an inference engine, i.e. when testing, validating, and predicting, though practically it will make no difference if your model does not include any of the differently behaving layers. For example batch norm, instancing norm, this includes submodules of RNN modules etc. Model.eval is a method of torch.inin.module. Eval sets the module in evaluation mode. This has any effect only on certain modules. See documentations of particular modules for details of their behaviors in training slash evaluation mode, if they are affected, for example dropout, batch norm, etc. This is equivalent with self.train false. The opposite method is model.train explained nicely by Umlang Gupta. An extra addition to the above answers. I recently started working with PyTorch Lightning, which wraps much of the boilerplate in the training validation testing pipelines. Among other things, it makes model.eval and model.train near redundant by allowing the train underscore step and validation underscore step callbacks which wrap the eval and train so you never forget to.